is the biggest capital campaign by the Archdiocese of Cincinnati in a half a century. The Archdiocese now wants to raise more than $100 million. The announcement coincides now with this year's Catholic Schools Week celebration. WLWT News Science Christy Davis looks at who the money could potentially help. This is a celebration of a way of life. The students in the pews represent more than 80 Cincinnati area Catholic schools, celebrating Mass for Catholic Schools Week. It's the Catholic school experience Christina Grimes wanted for her daughter. They provide everything you could need in spiritual and um, intellectual matters. It's an option the Archdiocese of Cincinnati would like to give more students, but Superintendent Jim Riggs says there's a major obstacle. Uh, in our studies and our research about Catholic education, we find that affordability is the number one reason why families cannot come to our Catholic schools. While Catholic Schools Week is designed to energize the community around education, Rick hopes it also excites wallets around the Archdiocese's historic fundraiser. The $130 million goal is a lot more than your weekly envelope in a basket. $65 million of those dollars would be set aside for schools. The majority of those funds will be used to start a needs-based tuition assistance fund for the families who attend our schools and who wish to attend our schools. That assistance would be for students who already meet academic enrollment standards. In fact, some of those students will already be enrolled. Families that wish to participate in it will need to apply and we'll use a third party uh, provider to do that. And then uh, we'll be told how much they need help. Grimes is all for allowing more kids to get the opportunity her daughter has had. I think nothing bad can come of helping people who maybe can't afford it themselves. The help will only come if the Archdiocese can reach its goal first. At St. Peter and Chains, Christy Davis, WLWT News 5. So Catholic Schools Week runs through February 1st, but the capital campaign is ongoing. Money will also go towards helping local parishes, priests, as well as service ministries.